Today I'm here to tell you about the iMusa 4 cup cappuccino and espresso machine. I love this so much. We recently went to Paris and just had the best coffee we've ever had and came right home and immediately needed to buy an espresso machine. Because we had little to no experience with making espresso, I took it to the reviews and started doing my research to find the best machine that wasn't too expensive but also made really great coffee and this was it for us. The machine is great because it does have a milk frother here on the side that we can froth milk in a separate container. It comes with a little carafe here that you use to pour the water into the top of the machine and it has three different settings here. I also love this one page quick start guide which is really a lifesaver whenever you're trying to do something new. It has the instructions and it even comes with this great little scoop here. When I'm ready to make espresso I just take the scoop out and put one level scoop into the filter bag then with the tamper, I pat down the coffee. I love utilizing this little hook because it holds the filter down while I'm using the tamper. Once the coffee is compact in, I just put it into the basket slot here up at the top and you just do a twisting motion to lock it into place. Then you'll just unscrew the lid and add the amount of water per how much coffee you would like to make. Once that is done, then you'll just screw the lid back on tight. Then you'll just turn the little button here on the side and that just turns on the espresso machine. I keep it on pause setting until I'm ready to hit brew. Then you're off to the races brewing your espresso and it only takes a minute or so. One thing I did want to note is it is a lighter machine so whenever you're doing anything such as removing a basket, you do kind of have to hold onto the machine so it doesn't move around. But to me, that's not a big issue because I do like how small it is and it does produce some really delicious espresso taking me back to France, the exact place where this obsession all happened. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this machine as much as I do.